Pete, can you talk about uh, being on site here and, and your excitement getting ready for this game? Yeah, it's nice to be down here. Obviously, Nashville is a, a fun city, a cool place. I've never spent an extended time here, so um, looking forward to the week and, and what we have at hand. How was the week of practice back in Auburn, kind of mixing young guys in and doing those things? How did that go for you guys? Uh, I think it was good. I, I'm, I was not there most of the week. Uh, I, was, I was sick, uh, came down with the flu. So, um, but from what I know, it was a good, good week of practice. So um, I think it's been good getting, getting those new guys in there. How do you balance sort of, you know, wanting to win the bowl game? There's a lot of new guys. It's a chance for them to get better. You're sort of already thinking about next year. How do you sort of balance all those things when you're preparing for a bowl? Yeah, it's hard. It's hard to balance. You know, you have that time off and then, Obviously, with the portal opening up and the high school guys having signing day, you know you're recruiting, and us players, you know, are doing our part and trying to help us out. So uh, it's weird because you're looking so much to next season and, and talking about you know next season. Uh, you know, we still have to finish off this season, so uh, we will get focused back up here, you know, at practice, and then uh, be ready to go on Saturday. How, how are you feeling after dealing with the play? You feeling good now? Uh, yeah, I'm feeling pretty good. So I don't, I don't think that'll be an issue moving forward. On the on the helmet communication topic, is that something you know? I, I know Auburn's not using it now. Something that you'd like to see kind of moving moving forward at some point in the future? Yeah, I think it could be cool for college football. Uh, you know, college is kind of behind the NFL and high school in terms of like technology usage. Um, so. Uh, the biggest thing I, that I want uh, is the iPads or the you know surfaces on the sideline. I, I think we have that, so that's what I've heard. Um, so that'd be cool to see next year uh, development for for college. But um, yeah, I don't, I don't know what where all that stands to be honest. How, how valuable is the experience of playing in bowl games before? When you get to this setting and you have a couple of days to kind of fine tune everything, you've been through this before. How valuable is that? Yeah, it's valuable. You know the guys that have that have done it before uh, can share with the younger guys that maybe haven't been a part of a bowl game you know it's a different experience obviously uh, you're practicing away from home you know you don't have your facility you don't have the hot and cold tubs and all that so uh, it's different but you just gotta you know stay locked in know know what you need to do and, and go out and take care of business and understand that you know we're here to win a football game you know this isn't vacation so uh, we'll have a good time but you know we're here we're here to play a game how much are you looking at this game as an opportunity to kind of just set the tone for next season? Yeah, it definitely is. Uh, you know, Coach Reeves was saying with, you know, a lot of guys playing that maybe didn't have a ton of a ton of reps this year, uh, it's exciting. You know, some people are nervous about that, you know, across the country, you know, for certain teams, I'm sure. But uh, for us, I think it's exciting to see uh, what we got moving forward and, uh, you know, get some of those guys to get a feel for the game and, you know, get, get a chance to make their first impression.